Okay, here's a tour. We've got this bugwam. That's a vitrifrigo fridge. And over here, we've got a little Trellino toilet. I'm a pro at the videos. Fridge, countertops. This thing was from DIY Van, I think. That came as a flat pack, just raw wood. We sanded and painted and assembled it. Uh, that's a Dometic or Suburban, I don't remember. A uh, little nice little two burner stove. We've got a piece of galvanized aluminum, galvanized steel up on top in case it gets a little too hot. Uh, over here we've got this sink from Tech Van Life. This thing turns around and it pulls out. Pulls out farther than that, but I got something sitting on it. Um, so that gives us water, hot and cold. And then this whole thing. It's in there. Like that. Uh, let's see, we got water pump, water propane powered water heater. Uh, this is the ceiling lights with dimmer. This is the Propex air heater. This is for this light here that doesn't exist. Uh, there's the Victron thing that tells you all the, all the magic and then all the different freshwater, wastewater, and LP. Those use Mopika sensors, Bluetooth sensors. So we can see what's going on there. Uh, we got these little lights from Amazon. They have a USB jack in the bottom. Um, Van Windows Direct. I 3D printed those little black things there. 3D printed this thing up on the top. Cover that up. Another window over there. These cushions were super expensive. We just ordered them from a, a local um, a local place that does upholstery. They let us try out a bunch of different densities of foam and we liked it. These things are Acacia from Home Depot. Uh, this one 18 inches it was cut down from a 24 inch piece and this one is 24 I think they're maybe 25 by inch and a half. Um, they're pretty light. This is like 45 pounds on this side and maybe 25 on this side so it's not and people say oh yeah if this was made out of oak it'd be 150 pounds but this acacia stuff is not not very heavy you can look it up uh, we got these boat latches off amazon so we've got drawers that come way out uh, this is real deep one we each get one of these for our clothes stuff in here. This is a little cool fan. It's got USB powered. Um, I think we should probably get a few more spices. More stuff. Under here we've got a, a little place. Let's see how do you get that out there. Place for Cutting boards and the griddle and the front pan. And this thing just sticks in there. How did she get that in there? I tell. Probably not holding a fan. Okay, uh, this is garbage. And then under there is the water heater. That's suburban, I don't know, three gallon or four gallon, something like that. You can see the fresh water tank and the pump is tucked under there. There's the propane and the CO detector. 
Yeah, over on this side we've got just a big, big area. Yeah, let go. We're not sure what we're gonna do there. That's the back of the toilet and the drain and the water. I don't know if we're gonna put a shelf in there or a door. I, I don't know. There's another CO. CO and propane detector. There's the SLK battery. And here's all the cool Victron junk with blinking lights on it. That's the wastewater tank. That's the Propex air heater. Um, there'll be panels in here. I just haven't put them in yet. We got a table. And this table, let's see if I can do this without making a big mess. Oh boy. Is it going to stay? All right, stay up. There's some professional photography here. Uh, this table, it, it's just on a, just on a stick. Because otherwise, yeah, I'm not narrow enough to get in there, but I can go in and sit. Yeah, sit over here. So this is our table, which also turns into the first time I've ever done this. Probably put some paint on that. The little stick comes out. For two short people and five eight. Ah, boy, I think we're gonna. These things are gonna be nice for reading, I guess, when you're sitting. Uh, got a fan up there. Uh, there's a fan up there. There's dimmable lights up here. That's about it. That's the the whole. Oh wait, we got. Let's go on the front here. Up above, that's where we put all of our bedding and all that. Um, that's a dog crate, foldable dog crate, and a dog bed. The dog crate fits in this area here behind the seats, then has straps that go around this bar and the bar on the driver's seat. Um, so it gets strapped in and the crate doesn't really go anywhere. Then when we're not using it, we just fold it up and it'll stick right in there. So there's another little fan window direct window over there. Uh, there's a window in the slider, bug wall. We got a bug wall back there. Uh, I'm gonna fill in those little little holes with something. So that's about it. <laughs>